Yo, 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 what's going on, you guys? How's everybody doing? You know who this is, the chosen one, Gabriel Skywalker from the DFS Club, and my main man right here, Schroeder Skywalker from the DFS Club. What's going on, guys? Coming to you guys with the NFL Monday Night Football Showdown. If you guys are new, please do us a solid. Hit that like button. Hit that subscribe button. Most importantly, leave us a comment down below. Leave us a comment down below, and I will tell you why there's a great incentive for you to do that. Um, you guys absolutely killed it with the views over the weekend. The NFL video broke the record. Um, even my MLB videos are still still, still holding strong for it being, you know, not just uh, MLB, you know. So thank you, thank you, thank you. The super thanks is down below. If you guys want to leave us a couple dollars in the tip jar. Schroeder and I really appreciate it. It goes to his uh, his child support fund and his his salmon treats that he gets at the end of every video. Um, what do you think about that, Jack? So thank you for all that donated. You do get a shout out on this video. Uh, if you donate a couple of bucks in the tip jar, and you get a very special message from Schroeder and myself, right? Oh yeah, dude. Because I got I got child support. I got I got kittens. Yeah, you got you got kittens, all right. You got shh, this guy. We fucking did it, guys. We won all the fucking money today. It was beautiful. We had a beautiful weekend. We're gonna get into it. There's so much to go over, but as you guys know, a Skywalker DFS show is not just for picks. It's a fucking show. So without further ado. You guys are going to be excited for this. Let's start the fucking show. Hit the music, Schroeder. Hit it. So all my NFL lineups today, all three DraftKings, Cash, I won 14x, 14 times. Uh, two out of three of my FanDuel cashed. Cashed very nicely. I added them in the big fucking, million, the Millie Makers did really good. But here's, here's what's up, guys. Check this shit out. This is for you. So, we have a lot of the best people in the world here in the DFS club. And I've been saying that forever. And I know everybody says that about their members, but this is what I'm talking about right here. One of our members was kind enough. He goes by in here, R, R. LaRose. I call him Mr. LaRose. Um, he was kind enough to donate 10, 10 DFS club memberships, guys. 10. So we're going to be giving away. This until they're all taken, 10 DFS club memberships. Shout out to our Relos for doing that. He sent me a DM and he was just like, look, we need more people in here. We need people to come in here and win money because we had we got something really good, something really special going on in here. Something real going on in here. Um, so you guys want to qualify. For a free one month membership sponsored by R Relos. Comment down below if you're not a member. Put you can comment anything, but make sure in your comment you put not a member. Because if you're already a member, you gotta tune in for the Thursday show. I give one away on Thursdays for anybody. But if you're not a member and you want to qualify, we're gonna do those every fucking night because the show goes on and we got generous fucking people in here. Real big shout out to our Relos for doing that. So if you want to qualify, um, comment down below. Comment not a member. All right. And, and then uh, tomorrow night, we'll start picking, guys. We'll start picking. And we'll do uh, one a night for the NFL video tonight. Or not tom tonight, but starting every video. So if I do an MLB video, NFL video, we're going to do one giveaway until all 10 are given away. How's that sound? Does that sound good? That sounds good to me. Again. Shout out to him, man. He just wants everybody in here because people think, and I get it. There's a lot of people on here that are trying to sell you a bag of goods 
and that's pretty much what you're getting but what we got in here is something real something special um and today ufc like four out of of my five ufc lineups cashed it was beautiful it's just we win so damn much and we're winning people money i know i joke around about the armani suits about the rolex watches we're flying in, in jet planes but we're changing lives in here man just from the winning so don't miss out on this free stuff get in that damn contest if you're not a member all right and if you are a member god bless you you already know what's up you already know what we're doing in here we made lots of money this weekend guys um first we got a shout out the uh the super thanks that we got from the nfl video First of all, some people sent me Cash App because you send it to me Cash App, YouTube doesn't take 30% or 40% of it or whatnot. So shout out to Naples. Mr. Naples uh, sent me a nice donation on uh, Cash App. So Naples, you are the chosen one. You're the real chosen one. Thank you so much. Schroeder and I really appreciate it. We got Barry Jones. Big Bar- Barry's been a viewer of mine for a while, man. Um Looking at his picture, man, I wouldn't want to mess with this guy. He looks, he looks like someone you don't want to mess with, but it's always the big guys, right? Big Barry here with a nine ninety nine don't know. Very nice, very thoughtful, very generous, Barry. Thank you so much for that nine ninety nine super thanks. It goes a long way for that child support, you know what I'm saying, and the salmon treats. So God bless you. God bless your family, and may takedowns come your way, sir. Thank you so much. Dave Barton, always donating every day. Great picks. Glad you're feeling better. I am. You can hear it in my voice. Um, thank you so much, Dave, for always donating. It all adds up, brother. $2, $1.50. I don't care. It all adds up. Thank you so much. I just, you guys really put my faith back in humanity, really. <laughs> um, and then Jan Burflin, always donating every single video. $2. Super thanks. Thank you so much, sir um again because of you schroeder is going to gain like five pounds every week with all the salmon treats so thank you so much jan i really appreciate it thank you so much for the super thanks and last but not least catcher ad just said thanks catcher ad like i said you are the real chosen one thank you so much man i really appreciate the super thanks um schroeder and i work hard on these videos man and you know when you guys get back it goes such a long way. So thank you so much. God bless you guys. I'm just riding high right now because of you, because of the people, because of the generosity going on right now. It's just, you know, we have fun on the show and I cuss a lot. You know, I'm just being me. Sometimes people don't like it. You know, I don't mean to offend anyone. I'm just being me. I'm not trying to be somebody else. Like, hi, welcome to my show. Let's get into these picks. Oh, golly gee. Maybe we shouldn't have done, you know, there's a hundred other people out there that do that. I'm just being me guys. So stay tuned, hit that subscribe button, hit that like button and get in that damn contest guys, get into it. So it's a showdown video. So it's a lot to go over tonight. I, I, I apologize, but you guys already know we got to brag a little bit, right? We got it. We got a show. I can't just say, come on here and say, Hey, we had a great weekend in the DFS club without actually fucking showing you. I can't do it. Um, I'll show you my personal lineups first. So I always give out my lineups. When you when you have a DFS club membership, you get my lineups included. All right. I do three lineups, not 150. I only do three because a lot of people don't play 150. A lot of people can't afford it. And what fun is that? No offense to the people that do, but I handpick my three lineups. And uh, may the best man win. I don't use optimizers. I go in the big contest. All right. So we played baseball too today because it was a good day to play baseball because there was so much overlay. Nobody was playing. Got a 227 on FanDuel. So very nice, man. Everybody that played that line did great. One of my three DraftKings came through. Could have been better, but I'll take it, man. I'll tell, winner's a winner, and then this is the NFL. So I gave out three FanDuel, three DraftKings. Two out of my three FanDuel cashed. Look at this, 758,000 entries, man. 
Holy shit. That's crazy. Got a 155 and then got a 154 on this one. It just stuck to the basics this week, guys. Stuck to the studs that we know, and it paid off. Uh, but in the Members Only podcast, uh, Space and I went over Mr. Dotson here from Washington. I didn't go over it in my video. Um, I have to save some stuff for the club, all right? This was my wild card. This was my ace in the hole. Um, the matchup was too good. The scouting report was phenomenal on Dotson. And I also read that Carson Wentz, this was his favorite target in the preseason. So how could I not take a shot with Dotson today, man? Had him 100% in every single lineup. Um, so two out of three FanDuel. And this was DraftKings, guys. 15x my entry fees. Winner. This is what we do. These are the three lines I gave out today, guys. Unbelievably good. We can go all the way up. Um, did I post UFC on this? This is my this is my, my line lineups channel where I give out my lineups. No, I didn't post it on here, but um, UFC real quick. Lots of winners. MTD Dirt went 250 bucks, came in ninth. Squallman almost took it down. Squallman is our sports wagering expert. Got a 712, man. Um, Rads had some winners. Woldley came in second. Almost a perfect card. Tony Ferguson is washed. And then this was mine. So gave out five lineups. Almost swept it. Almost. Almost. Vandal got a 690, won 18 bucks. Two out of three of my Fandles cashed. 609, won 15 bucks. So we did great in UFC, guys. And then the Hall of Fame, the Hall of Fame, Blackhawk and tonight's showdown, which was a complete and utter shit show. Boy, both these teams, <sighs> rough, rough. Blackhawk came in ninth. Very nice, dude. Mr. Sparky today. Look at this. 750, 250. Ten dollars. Oreo with some prize picks because we do prize picks, guys. We do everything. Mr. Daniel Levine played my lines, won two hundred and eighteen dollars. That's what's up, dude. The Hitman nine nine zero zero did some cashing today. Baseball because we played MLB today, guys. We did both. I was up at the butt crack of dawn because the MLB slate and the NFL slate started at the same time because I'm a man of my word, guys. You get every single sport with the club. Oreo, Oreo, I want that link to that other Discord, bro. You got to hook it up. Super draft winner there. Big Ben, 194 tonight. Um, he said $40 profit. Very nice. Mr. Parrish, early in Maine, he said he won 860 bucks tonight. That's what's up, dude. So many fucking winners, man. Um, hard hitter. What's up, man? Hard hitter's the man. Got a 180. My DraftKings, I'll just tell you right now, got right at, I'll say 200. 200 fantasy points. All right? That's how we won all that money. Um, hard hitter. Got one 400 bucks here, the 180. And then one 225 with a 160. And then Sven says, thank you. As always, my beautiful brother Skywalker DFS, he won 368 bucks with my lineups, guys. I'm gonna keep going. I'm gonna keep going. It's it's just guys, I can go on and on and on. This was all the last two days, guys. What are we doing here? What do we do? It's this is what I'm talking about. You guys gotta come join up. I know we're 15 minutes into the fucking video here. We haven't gone over the slate yet, but there's tons of stuff we got to do. We're giving free shit away, guys. But if you don't want to wait around, you want to come join the DFS club. You want to come join the winning fucking team. This is it. You get all my lineups, guys. You get the ownership, the projections, the top stacks. Look at our slideshow, guys. We're the best in the industry. We're only $14.99 a month. That's it. That's for everything. Every contest that DraftKings offers, we cover it. You get everything. Everything, all the tools, the ownership, the top stacks, the projections, the members only podcast one hour before lock exclusively to the DFS club. Nowhere else. My brother, DFS space and myself had a hell of a podcast this morning for NFL. We knocked it out. They laid it up. 
we knocked it out of the fucking park. Click join now. Make sure you click on my logo, Skywalker DFS. Because we're playing MLB this week, guys. NFL's not till Thursday and Sunday, so we got to do something till then. So why not just fucking make some money in MLB? Here we go. Pick your plan. It's that simple. Bronze, silver, gold plans. Our gold plans, which are one years, is cheaper than everybody else's monthly plans. And that's just, they just offer football. All right? Good luck when NBA and NHL come around. Trust me when I say this. We are the cheapest in the business, and we take pride in that. Because it's about getting 1,000, 2,000, 3,000 members, man. We're looking to take over just to make this, this business honest again. That's it. We want to make it the realest and the honest, and we're well on our way, guys. These price tags speak for themselves. We got three-day passes. Again, we cover price picks, sports wagering. A lot of states are legalizing gambling. Um, California, vote yes on that proposition so we can get it legalized here in California. Let's go, guys. DFSclub.com. Again, you want to wear the Armani suits. You want to fly in those private jet planes. You want a cat here that has more girlfriends than he knows what to do with. That's right. You tell him, Schroeder. Schroeder's got a gold chain. 24 karat gold chain for my cat. Living in mansions. DFSclub.com, guys. Right, Schroeder? Come join the winning team. All right. So we got all the homework out the way. Let's get into this fucking slate. I, I saw this slate, and I, I literally... My wife looked at me and she said, you don't look too good. I said, yeah, I think I just threw up in my fucking mouth. This late, woo. But you know what? I think I found an edge. And for our showdown, right off the bat, guys, do not blow your whole bankroll on fucking showdowns. Don't be like a drunken redneck on payday. These are for fun. All right. We play the big money in the main slates. Play these like it's entertainment. Like you're buying a pizza or something like that. Don't go overboard, all right? That's lesson number one. Lesson number two, have fun, all right? This is for fun. Let's go to the position optimizer. Let's go to single game. We got Denver versus Seattle. Oh, sorry. Sorry. Ew. We got Geno Smith against Russell Wilson, guys. I'm telling you right now. So, Russell Wilson, 11.8K. He's on Denver now, in case you didn't know, in case you didn't get the memo. Um, he's a little expensive. I'm curious to see how he does on this team. I think maybe he does better. I think um, Seattle didn't let him pass the ball as much as he wanted to. You guys know the Seattle system. Run, 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 right? They got four running backs. You guys know the system. So I think Russell Wilson's going to air it out. I think he might be a candidate this week for a captain. Um, but if you can't afford him at captain, there's other captains out there. I think that, you know, we can get an edge on. So I like Russell Wilson. Geno Smith, on the other hand, this guy couldn't even cut it on the Jets. And now he's on Seattle. He's 8.6K. He's very cheap, but he's very cheap for a reason. This is Geno Smith, guys. Former New York Jet. Couldn't cut it. Now he's the, the head. It's going to be a very long season. Very long season for Seattle. Geno Smith. Is he necessary? No, he's not. But 8-6, he is affordable. Is he a great play? Absolutely not. Is he a good play? Absolutely not. Could he get lucky and throw two or three maybe touchdowns? Maybe, but what's been going on here, guys? What's been going on since Thursday night? The common sense plays are the ones that are working. You have Patrick Mahomes. You had the usuals this week. You should have done really good. When you, If you got too cute, that's when you weren't cashing today, right? So I'm going to keep going that way. So it telling me, saying that, is Geno Smith really a good play? Probably not. But let's look at running backs here. So... We got some overpriced running backs. We got Javante Williams. He's 10.2K. Are we going to pay 10.2K? Let me ask you this. For a player that's probably going to get 50% of the touches, maybe 60 if we're lucky. 
He's going to split the backfield with Melvin Gordon at 7-4. Way too much, I think, for Javante Williams. Way too much for Melvin Gordon. Um, good luck picking one. I'm not going to get to Javante Williams. I absolutely have to get one. I'd probably go with the cheap one with Melvin Gordon, and that's a fucking stretch. Um, Rashad Penny, I would assume, would be the bell cow for Seattle. Uh, Kenneth Walker, the third, he's questionable. He didn't practice, so it's not looking good. He's the backup. So I would think Travis Homer here at 1.4K could be a valuable play for a pump play. Maybe he's the backup. That's what I'm thinking. I'm looking at the pecking order here. Um, it would have to be Homer. So I think for 1.4K, he's worth a worth a risk, worth a punt. But Rashawn Penny, I like him. The only thing I don't like is the game script. Um, Denver's probably going to be up, probably going to be up by two or three touchdowns. And then Seattle's going to have to abandon the running game. So that could leave you with Rashad Penny just sitting on the bench. But at the same time, maybe he goes out there and gets some receptions, right? He's not a big receptions type of running back, but he might be forced to be. You know what I'm saying? So that or they throw Homer out there to get all the receptions. So don't mind the penny play here at 7.8K because I know he's going to be the RB1. I don't mind the homer play as a punt play at $1,400. Javante Williams, Melvin Gordon, I think we're overpaying. And you guys already know my number one thing I hate the most is overpaying for players. Let's go to wide receiver. And Schroeder hates overpaying for child support. All right. So there's some that wide receivers where we're going to, where we're really going to break this down, where we're really going to get different on this slate. Cause I think this is where it's going to make or break you. Corlin Sutton's 9.4 K. <sighs> He's got Russell Wilson throwing him the ball this year. So these Denver receivers, it's a bump to them. He's nine, four Jerry Judy's eight, two. I think they're both firmly in play. If I had to pick one, I think Jerry Judy, I think this is his breakout year. He's 8.2K. Um, you can obviously roster both. I would stack them up with your quarterback. Make sure you correlate at least two pass catchers with your quarterback. Rule number one, especially. Don't forget about that rule, guys. Um, but, yeah, I think they're both firmly in play. If I had to put choose one, give me Jerry Judy at 8.2K. I think that's good value. This is where I'm going to look at the roster here. Not the running backs so much. I'm going to the wide receivers here. DK Metcalf, he's going to have Geno Smith throwing him the ball. 8.4K. If I could, if I can get away with it, I'm going to fade Seattle. I know you got to roster at least one Seattle player. I'm probably going DK Metcalf. Because if they're down, which I, I assume Seattle's going to be down big, they're going to have to throw the ball no matter what. So running backs are going to sit. These these wide receivers are going to be out on the field. Tyler Lockett, 7K. You get to both of them, it's going to be kind of expensive. But if you're going to run a uh, be just to be different, right, maybe this game here turns out to be the turning point where it's like an out-of-the-blue like team that's not supposed to go off goes off. You can do a Metcalf Lockett stack. Pair him up with fucking uh, Geno Smith. That's up to you. So here's the important news. So KJ Hamler, he was limited. If he's out, I like Montreal, Montreal, sorry, Montreal, Washington at $200. Hey, I think he's got a, play, a chance to play if KJ Hamler's out. KJ Hamler's in. I don't think we got to go there for 200 bucks. Even with, we got, you know, D. Eskridge going up against Denver. I mean, this is what we're, we're looking at with Seattle. I don't think I'm going to get there, but maybe he gets one or two receptions, maybe, in garbage time. I'm trying to look at garbage time here, guys, because I think there's going to be garbage time. So, like, Eskridge, I mean, Marquise Goodwin is even on the fucking team. Like, I'm going to have to double check, but I know Eskridge is. Um, I know Washington's there, so for garbage time, maybe these guys get some, but if K.J. Hamler plays, I like him. I don't think it's a bad play um, for 4.4K. But, yeah, give me Judy, give me Sutton, and then one of the one of these guys, Metcalf or Lockett, I'd probably go 
Metcalf for fourteen hundred dollars more. He just been over the years. He's been more consistent. That's the only reason why. But Lockett's fine too. Tight ends, holy shit, it's bad. I'm probably gonna fade tight end. Um, you got Albert here. He's gonna have Russell Wilson throwing him the ball. Um, he's five K. I gotta see it first. I gotta see it first. No offense. Normally a decent, not good, but a decent tight end. But you know, Geno Smith's on him the ball. So six two, that's a little much. That's a little much. So I don't think I'll get to the tight ends. Um, unless you want to punt here with with big country, Will Disley. Yeehaw. Montana's own Will Disley, only 800 bucks. You know he's gonna be out there. He's normally out there for his blocking, but Will Disley, man, if he gets the ball. He can break some tackles. I've seen him break five tackles and run it to the house. So, hey, this is my favorite punt play on the slate is going to be Will Disley at only 800 bucks. All he needs is one catch, guys. One. Can we get one, Will? Can we get one? I know it's not up to you, but if Geno Smith can just throw him one ball, that'd be awesome. Will Disley, only $800. And then kickers, I probably, you know, both kickers are firmly in play here. I probably go, I don't know, 50 50. I wouldn't roster two kickers, guys. But on FanDuel, the last two showdown slates, the, op, the, the winner had the fucking defense in there. Broncos defense looks pretty good this game against Geno Smith. Yeah, give me the Broncos defense here, especially on FanDuel, man. Um, FanDuel's just been working out great for defenses, for showdowns so far can't believe I'm saying that, but the last two, it I mean, the first, the Thursday night game, the optimal had both defenses on it. So tonight it was just the, the Tampa Bay defense. So Broncos defense looks pretty good at 4.8. Fuck, I might go that route, man. All right, so that's it for the watch players. I mean, the optimizer. So if you want to go like a Jerry Judy captain here, that's fine. Like, I don't mind that. We already got Russell Wilson in here. We got Rashad Penny, DK Metcalf, KJ Hamler. And then uh, give me uh, Will Disley. And then we can go up to, you can get Geno Smith if you got to get that two quarterback in. Or we can go Tyler Lockett, which is probably what I would do. I would go a lot more fucking Denver Henry, though. So instead of a Metcalf, maybe we'll go Sutland because we already got Judy there. Uh, we're still under, right? We got Rashad Penny, Russell Wilson, because Will Disley's the key. Will Disley's the key, guys. So, and then Tyler Lockett. If you don't want Tyler Lockett and you want to go really Denver heavy, you can go Melvin Gordon. Um, Hamler, but he's banged up, man. I'd probably just, I'd probably just stick to Lockett. So you got one pass catcher, one running back for Seattle, right? So I mean, there's a lot of ways to go, but again, I think my strategy is going to be stack Denver um, as much as I can and go to those pass catchers and maybe look out for the game script of it being garbage time and these Joe Schmoes go out there, these two hundred dollar players go out there. And it was nice. We kind of got the news tonight about these uh, these scratches, and then they showed up as out on DraftKings. So make sure you guys are paying attention to that. That's kind of cool. They didn't do that last year. Mm, excuse me. So, again, guys, Schroeder and I would love to say thank you. This is a close-up. Look at this specimen right here. You know, cats hating looking at themselves in the mirror. They must hate looking at themselves on, on the screen too, right? Tell them. <laughs> yeah you handsome boy you um thank you guys so much for all the love again you guys want a free one month dfs club membership doesn't cost you anything doesn't cost you anything our members are giving them away he bought 10 dfs club memberships for the sole purpose that he wants to get 10 people in here that have never experienced this and win some fucking money comment down below Put not a member and then comment whatever you want with it. You'll be in the drawing. We'll do it every single video starting tomorrow. 
um, until all 10 are gone. All right. Um, yeah, man. Special shout out. You the man, bro, for for buying 10 memberships for total strangers that that he's never even met. These these are the type of people we have in here, guys. Um, and you guys for watching these videos, you guys killed it with the views. I just want more comments. Comment, 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 comment. Let's get over a hundred, Schroeder. Right? If you guys want to throw us a couple of bucks in the tip jar, I, I guess I'll leave I'll leave my cash app in the description. You can do cash app or you can hit the super thanks button. The super thanks button's probably a lot more convenient. You just hit the button. Um, some people like to do the cash app better, which I get. So it all goes to me. YouTube don't get their cut. It all goes to Schroeder. Actually, not me, but yeah, that's right, buddy. You tell him. He's all me. It goes to me. Thank you guys so much. Schroeder, do we not have the best audience in the world or what? You guys are the real ones. Thank you all so much. Thank you, thank you, thank you. I'm probably going to take an hour break, and then I'm going to get ready for tonight's MLB video, guys. That's right. We're going to do an MLB video, so you guys keep watching them. I'll keep making them. That's my promise to you, and you guys are watching them, So, and we're winning. So thank you so much, Schroeder and I. We love you. God bless you. Schroeder, let us get the fuck out of here. We'll see you guys in a bit. Subscribe and comment and hit that like button. Thank you so much. Take care, guys.